Hi guys. Well, it ended up being a fine fall day. A fine. That will be a fine Monday after a slow start. It ended up being a lovely day here in the end times. Monday, October 11th, 2021. So, uh, I have been out doing some planet nibbling, getting ready for the latest manifestation here at Bugs in a Jar Farm. You might remember last year, my plans for my bridge to nowhere, where uh, Basil and I got the underground power line and the septic line. We got it to right here and then kind of ran into this problem. And, uh, so there is, I don't know, when all is said and done, pretty much $1,000 pissed away into a big hole in the ground. <coughs> and now Rob and I need to figure out how to clip this and get this out of here. So anyway, on Saturday, we're bringing a serious planet eating machine in here uh, to uh, what we're doing is kind of making this whole area a continuation of the bog garden and there's the pond on this side I need to keep this road somewhat open but all of this this is part of my uh, flood control channel coming through here so this is my vision is uh, so what I'm planning for this missing link between the bog garden and the pond, since the bridge to nowhere never materialized, uh, this is going to be kind of like my little Japanese tea garden, I guess. So this is actually going to be an island. So the this is all going to be a uh, some, somewhere between a moat a bog garden and a pond. I don't know, I just kind of imagine the love child between a moat, a bog garden, and a pond, and uh, with an island in the middle of it. So I have been out here with my little planet eating weed whacker, and Lord. And uh, so all of this is going to be water. It's only going to be about three feet deep. It's not going to be like my eight foot deep pond. So this whole thing is going to be about three feet deep and uh, filled with all kinds of water lilies and marsh marigolds and uh, irises and water hyacinths and whatnot and then uh, there used to actually be a big apple tree here, but what we're going to do is uh, we're going to raise this whole island probably by 12 to 18 inches higher than it is and uh, plant a uh, weeping willow tree will be the dominant tree here. Uh, so the, the island will be a big round weeping willow tree. And sometime in the future. And that is the vision here. And uh, don't know whether we're going to have some sort of little gazebo or what the hell we're going to have up here. But you got to keep the vision going. You know, I just do not know why I keep doing this. This is $1,000 I'm getting ready to give this guy on Saturday. $1,000, we're going to end up with one big fucking muddy mess. This is going to be a nasty, ugly, muddy mess out here. But, uh, <coughs> summer of 2022 will be here before we know it. We just have to get through the fall of 2021 and, uh, then the winter, figure out what the fuck I'm doing for six months and come back to 
to uh, keeping the vision going at bugs in a jar. And uh, so tomorrow I am off to uh, Vermont to look at the leaves. I'm heading out of here uh, tomorrow morning, spend the night in the Adirondacks uh, tomorrow night. And then I will be in the great state of Vermont for one night on Wednesday. So uh, I will not be able to visit any tribes members on this trip. I'm going to take the ferry across on Wednesday, spend one night at my sister's. I'm not allowed inside my sister's house. Uh, so I'm going to be spending Wednesday night in my sister's screened in tiny house. Spend the night in her tiny house since I am not allowed in her house since I am not vaccinated. Uh, then I got to scoot back on Thursday. Cause we got more Airbnbers coming in on Friday and we got some planet eating on Saturday. So I should be able to get a video or two out on a uh, on Wednesday night from my sisters from Vermont so I will send you some pretty leaf pictures I highly advise you get out there and enjoy the pretty leaves while you still can what do you think little dog are you ready to head to Vermont tomorrow bye guys